Well, since the last video, I had my shower and I shaved a little bit, so things have changed a little bit. I've had my workout at the gym yesterday and I was all sweaty, so I had to shower to get the sweat off, but just wanted to come on and kind of show little demos. I did kind of get a little bit more carved into these wise men here, kind of along the backs of their heads and under their chins and things like that. Just needed to get the extra work done and, and do it a little bit away from the camera, but I'd say it's going to come a time when we get down to these other jobs and <coughs> come to be about to deciding that um, we're going to kind of make the noses of Mary and Joseph here and you kind of see here how I've kind of lined it up in a way where it's like try to get it where Mary's mouth is about equal to the bottom of Joseph's mustache and then at, at the top of Joseph's mo mustache is where you want to draw the line from to be the place where Mary's nose will go and think we're going to try to get the same little step taken on this other little one too and then try to make the next little step come along and try to get a little more lined up than this I say you know things were always kind of different for us all different places times in our lives and then I say that we've got a little square we make here for the nose of Mary and might even come out a little thinner on the other than it did on this one but we know that um there are certain lines we need to draw to go across the little figures and make them so they're going to be a little happy ways as they go. Whoa, whoa, I say, kind of got the face in here. And then again, kind of make little lines where we're going to try to put little eyes into little Joseph now and kind of try to put a line here and a line there and kind of go along where we got the little places just where they all ought to be and then kind of go along and make it the way it's going to look as we get along to it and put a little faith into our work decide to kind of take the same lines and draw from about the same place I've get gotten to where I've gotten so good with my eyes that I don't need metric or, or rulers all that much in some cases so sort of like I say we got a place in the middle where the staff is and kind of got to take that out of there to make it so it's going to just be what it's going to be and so try to make the line along the way you know we've got it probably about as far as it'll go try to make it so it lines up to the center in the best way it can and I tell you there's little errors and things we have to fix now and then because there's going to be little careless mistakes to come along the way and you know I say that there's places where we get a little lines and I say that um perhaps 
we don't know whether if for these we're going to have arms and legs or not. It's probably something we're just going to have yet to the side. It might just really be a decision to make. And there are certain steps I think we're going to try to take as we go. There's just so much figuring to do as we come along and make our way about what we do. And oh, I say that a little light can shine on our world. And oh, I say brighter days, brighter nights. Oh, what it all going to be. Oh, what's it all going to be, I say. And finally get a place where we kind of got two thumb guards on get one to give you extra protection and hold the other one on. I mean, two stay on better than one, it seems. I have discovered from the work I've done and decided at this point, since we got the mouth out, we might as well go ahead and try to put a little bit of a nose in to try to make her so... She's going to be a little thing that we shall do and come down to it and see how this is just going to be the little work we have in our little selves and our ways and make it so we're going to try to manage our work in ways we do all things, I say, and then try to put a little place in the dent where we got the little line to go and then try to make another little extra line to go the little bit of an extra way and take it where it's going to be just what it needs to be to make it so she gets to be a successful type of a nativity figure and then just a little bit of extra work that kind of ties it in for what we got here. And then kind of try to see what it's all up to. And finally we come down to where we get the little place put in. And then... say this is just what it's going to need to be sooner or later. feel these days like this is just what it's come down to being. I think I'm going to try to probably at least maybe get the little more detail knife and which is better for these little steps than anything else is and try to work our way along in it to make it so she's going to be a little bit of a nice little gesture of a figure for us to see what she's going to be like when we all get done and oh well, like work is just taking its way making it so we kind of make a little life out of it and kind of put little tiny bits of life in our work and finally get the little face carved out. And you see, this is where we've come down to it. I say, I say that there's just a lot to come along. I think we're going to try to go up a little bit, make these lines, these little cuts, these little valleys that go up to the eyelid. And of course, there's going to be times it's going to chip off too much. But you can always come back and cover that up with whatever you need to do. Make little new opportunities out of your old mistakes and kind of try to learn a little bit from what you do and all that you have. And 
little ways you learn like in life how brighter days, brighter futures and nights have and all the things I say that it's just going to be worth in the end and sometimes I think that it was just kind of things that make it where we do a little bright shiny work of an art and do a little crazy things I say and then and then just work away about it do the work that is all about you and what you need to do thinking about the days when you're going to be working along trying to find a little rhythm to take and then make it so the eyes are shining light in what you can do make it so it's brighter each and every day I say oh little work go into her head and come along she brights every day like this and just a little art can make you happy as you can be to see little things you do and how it's all going to shine your little light out of your system and make it so this is going to be glorious little work to come along and then get it where we see her face just as it ought to be and I'd say there's probably going to be more work to come along like this might even do the other one a little ways from the video but I'd say that we finally rounded things off made it so she's looking a lot better and there's going to come a day when hopefully I can get a little more together make a better video for us all to see and hear and know and show and I say that that's where we got the face done right in I say this is going to be a time when this knife is going to need to be sharpened and we're going to get a moment to do that but here's where we all come along I'm going to try to carve into Joseph's face to try to carve in the little place that is right above his eyes to make the brow of his forehead and then try to make the next little cut to go along here sometimes there are things in life where you know you have so many good materials on hand that you know you might as well make two of something while you can and I say for this work is coming its way we finally got one place cut out for one little place of an eye and another little place to go along for the next little place of an eye and then try to carve it along make it so he's going to be a better character of all things to see how light shall shine in us do us right and make us all see character and things this is almost like some of the faces how they were for some of the Santa Clauses that I carved and try to go along the brow here as well oh I say making the same little line oh like work 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 it's all coming its way think for a moment that might be getting a little thirsty here and you know work can be good it can put you in place it can make something better of you 
sometimes when you shift around on things, it kind of helps you a little bit. Kind of makes it so you work a little better with your hands. Make it so it kind of comes a little better. I think maybe it might be a good time to go ahead and round off these crowns for these wise men. Try to put a little place to work the way that we do inside the figures of life and everything and then get to the point where we're going to see so much more as to what will come out of this and beauty is in the work of the art I say it almost kind of looks like he has an afro there but once we get little other things put in it is going to look like a crown and it's going to be a crown you know all the work is taking us where we see little light and beauty and fire in our souls oh blessed life oh work do come on come on a little time in life where everything works out just doing us all the more for the better kind of got to keep a watch out since I'm kind of doing a little online business now because you know it's like I've still just kind of got my job at the school cafeteria I'm going to need to watch out on there make sure I don't have any students following my posts or my videos don't know if it's ever going to happen that whenever I get back out in the cafeteria to go pick up trays if any of these students are ever going to be around and telling me they saw me on the internet or anything I made or did or have any questions about it but it's going to be one of those things where I just kind of have to not answer because you know I'd get in trouble if I had to be corresponding with any of them and that's one of the main reasons why I just don't really take messages on my sites except from really close friends because you know it's one of those things where I don't need a lot of strangers coming in contact with me and certainly don't need kids in, in that school where I work coming in contact with me it's against the law and against at least in Kentucky and with Fayette County Schools that you have any students interacting with you on social media there's just a lot of reasons why it just has to do with safety and all and just all the ways they kind of tell us to avoid any physical activity that could probably limit us in any way during the work day and that's just kind of among things they tell us with those sites because you know there's never anything you know with those sites where anything you do when you're not at work can make anything different or uncomfortable in the work environment while you're at work so there's so much to watch out for and take care of when it comes to those sites and I do think with this wise man there's one little step I was doing on all the others that I forgot to do while I was off video that is take care of this area on the back of the head so round off the back of the head like I say and get to demonstrate right now exactly how I did that particular step coming along the way there gets to be little moments where you know you'll have tired little hands and then I say that um there's going to be gifts to bring I say like it in these wise men's hands it would be a little hard to try to carve in a gold or a frankincense or a myrrh or something like that so we kind of have to take everything the best we can do it and see how that goes for us because there's been a lot of things I've done over the years where 
some things have just turned out as the same old and the same old. It's just the little ways we work coming about these things. Do think for a little video I've probably taken a while here. It's this video is not as long as others I've made in this series, but a little longer than others I've made in other series. But it just comes a time when we have to clean up, put things away, take care of our work a little more. And I'd say it's getting to the point where I'm getting about tired and have worked so much and I think it's to the point where it's probably time for me to close off and end. And I thank you all for coming on and watching me and take care and hope you will subscribe to this channel if it so interests you and would like to get as many subscribers as I can. So just be watchful and take care. I will see you in the next video.